ಸದಾಶಿವಸಮಾರಂಭಾಚಾರ್ಯಮಧ್ಯಮಾಚಾರ್ಯಪರ್ಯಂತಾ ವಂದೇ ಗುರುಪರಂಪರಾ ನೈಷ್ಕರ್ಮ್ಯ ಸಿದ್ಧಿ ಸೆಕೆಂಡ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಪೇಜ್ ನಂಬರ್ ಸೆವೆಂಟಿ ನೈನ್ ವರ್ಸ್ ನಂಬರ್ ನೈಂಟಿ ಫೈವ್ ಇಂಟ್ರಡಕ್ಷನ್ ಎಟ್ ದ ಬಾಟಮ್ ಅತಶ್ಚಾತ್ಮನೋ ಭೇದ ಅಸ್ಪರ್ಶ ಭೇದ ಮಿಥ್ಯಾ ಸ್ವಾಭಾವ್ಯ ಅತಃ ಆಹ in our vedantic teaching tradition our acharyas introduce adhyaropa apavada method adhyaropa means superimposition apavada means negation ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಅಪವಾದ ಆದಿಶಂಕರಾಚಾರ್ಯ ಇನ್ ಹೀಸ್ ಗೀತಾ ಭಾಷ್ಯಂ ಹೀ ರೈಟ್ಸ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಅಪವಾದಾಭ್ಯಾಂ ನಿಷ್ಪ್ರಪಂಚಂ ಪ್ರಪಂಚತೆ ಶಿಷ್ಯಾಂ ಸುಖಬೋಧಾರ್ಥ ತತ್ವಜ್ಞೈ ಕಲ್ಪಿತ ಕ್ರಮ ತತ್ವಜ್ಞೈ ಬೈ ದ ವೈಸ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಕಲ್ಪಿತ ಕ್ರಮ ದಿಸ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಅಪವಾದ ಈಸ್ ಇಂಟ್ರಡ್ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಬೈ ಅವರ್ ವೈಸ್ ಪೀಪಲ್ ಜ್ಞಾನೀಸ್ ಕಲ್ಪಿತ ಕ್ರಮ ಫಾರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಪರ್ಪಸ್ ಶಿಷ್ಯಾಂ ಸುಖಬೋಧಾಯ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಈಸಿ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ಈಸಿ ಕಮ್ಯುನಿಕೇಷನ್ ಸುಖಬೋಧಾಯ ಫಾರ್ ಈಸಿ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡಿಂಗ್ ಫಾರ್ ದ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ಸ್ ಟು ಗೆಟ್ ನಾಲೆಡ್ಜ್ ಈಸಿಲಿ ದಿಸ್ ಮೆಥಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಅಪ್ಲೈಡ್ ಇನ್ ಅವರ್ ವೇದಿಕ್ ಟ್ರೆಡಿಷನ್ ಟೀಚಿಂಗ್ ಟ್ರೆಡಿಷನ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಅಪವಾದ ಬೋತ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟರಿ ಸೂಪರ್ ಇಂಪೋಸಿಷನ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ನೆಗೇಷನ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅಪವಾದ ಬೋತ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಂಪ್ಲಿಮೆಂಟರಿ ಬೋತ್ ಆರ್ ಇಂಪಾರ್ಟೆಂಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಂಟ್ರಡ್ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಅಪವಾದ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ನಾಟ್ ರೆಲವೆಂಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದಯರ್ ಸೂಪರ್ ಇಂಪೋಸಿಷನ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ದಯರ್ ಅಪವಾದ ಈಸ್ ಇರ್ರೆಲವೆಂಟ್ ಇಫ್ ಅಪವಾದ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಇಂಟ್ರಡ್ಯೂಸ್ಡ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಈಸ್ ಇನ್ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ವಿತೌಟ್ ಇಂಟ್ರಡ್ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ಅಪವಾದ ವಿತೌಟ್ ಇಂಟ್ರಡ್ಯೂಸಿಂಗ್ ಅಪವಾದ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಈಸ್ irrelevant each one is relevant without the other that is why it is complementary that is why both are important superimposition is also important adhyaropa and negation is also important apavada since both are complementary when the student is listening this adhyaropa apavada student definitely feel there is a contradiction in teaching there is a contradiction in teaching for example shruti talks about creation srishti in taitri upanishad chandogya upanishad in every upanishad maximum srishti is introduced 
this is superimposition adhyaropa the same adhyaropa the srishti which is superimposed by the upanishads when acharyas um, use that method again later they negate that creation that means upanishad negate the creation there is no creation there is creation tasmad va etasmad atmanah akasya sambhutah onwards srishti that is adhyaropa na kinchit jayate upanishad says nothing is born negation this uh, is the place where the student feel confused if a student is very bright skillful student skill is there the student um, has to understand where that uh, superimposition has been done where negation has been done because many times the teacher may not implicitly explicitly talk about that superimposition and negation many times the teacher may not talk about that very explicitly but the teacher present it implicitly implicitly means indirectly indirectly guru talks about srishti pravesha anupravesha all this and uh, guru indirectly talks about negation also this is the place where the student has to use his or her skill after later timings whenever any topic comes where it is adhyaropa where it is apavada both are important i should not hold on to adhyaropa only unfortunately many students stuck with adhyaropa and uh, they cannot come out of that uh, that is another viparita bhavana upanishad all acharyas traditional acharyas deliberately do this this is the viparita bhavana created by shastra itself by that gurus they themselves introduce deliberately this adhyaropa therefore we should not get confused even though shastra introduce adhyaropa gurus are talking about that method the student must be agile enough later apavada when teacher introduce happily the student has to give up that adhyaropa happily that viparita bhavana it is a deliberate viparita bhavana and deliberately shastra negate deliberately apavada also deliberate idea adhyaropa is also a deliberate idea shastra does that is why we say vedanta shastram is difficult for those students who are not very very serious and studious <laughs> student means what actually what is the meaning of student the one who is studious at his or her studies shastrik studies that uh, person is called student vidyarthi so therefore srishti prakriya when it is introduced adhyaropa when it is uh, negating srishti is not there you must accept that also as you have accepted the shruti srishti that much you have to accept srishti negation so sureshwara acharya is struggling to communicate lot of adhyaropa apavadas are there you have to understand carefully atma anatma anatma is introduced for example sadhana chatushtaya sampatti is introduced highly in our shastra even shankaracharya in viveka chudamani he says sadhana nyatra chatvari 
देर आर् फोर टाइप्स ऑफ साधना चतुष्टय संपन्न कथिता निमनीषि सेड बै आर् वैज पीपल यु सत्षु सन्निष्ठा यदभाव सिद्ध्यति साधन चतुष्टे संपत्ति सत्वे मोक्ष सिद्ध्यति साधन चतुष्टय संपत्ति अभाव मोक्ष अभाव क्लियरली आचार्य स्टाक अबउट साधन चतुष्टय संपत्ति दिस इज अनदर टाइप ऑफ अध्यारोप विपरीत भावना विवेक वैराग्य शमदमादि षटक संपत्ति इफ यू आर् नाट क्वालिफाइड यू आर् नाट एलिजिबल फॉर मोक्ष यू विल नाट गेट मोक्ष दिस इज वाट शास्त्र सीज देन स्टूडेंट स्टार्ट वरी नो नो ई डोंट हेव शम ई डोंट हेव दम हौ कैन ई गेट मोक्ष ई डोंट हेव दिदीक्ष लाइक दट ई डोंट हेव वैराग्य विवेक वेन ऐम गोइंग टू गेट मोक्ष सो डेलिबरेटली शास्त्र इंट्रड्यूस साधन चतुष्ट संपत्ति सो डैरेक्टली आचार्य इंट्रड्यूस दट अध्यारोप साधन चतुष्ट संपत्ति बिकाज वन यू से साधन चतुष्ट संपत्ति इज देर मोक्ष विल सिद्ध्यति सिद्ध्यति मोक्ष इज पासीबल आचार्य सैड यदे न सिद्ध्यति न If sadhana chetushta is sampatti is not there, moksha is not possible. Acharya, how boldly said that. <coughs> that means what? Moksha becomes conditional. If these conditions are there, sadhana chetushta is sampatti conditions are there. Don't ask me what is sadhana chetushta is sampatti. Okay. Viveka, Vairagya, Shamadama, Adhishatka, Sampatti, Mumukshutvam, all these are not there. न सिद्ध्यति मोक्ष अड़ते इफ दीज कंडीशन आर् नाट देर साधन चतुष्ट संपत्ति कंडीशन आर् नाट देर मोक्ष इज नाट पासीबल वाट वी से जनरली वाट इज द मोक्ष डेफिनेशन दिसफिनेशन आफ मोक्ष आफ शंकराचार्य विवेक चूड़ाणि इज अध्यारोप ऐम गिविंग एग्जापल This is an adhyaropa, superimposition only. Moksha is not conditional at all. Moksha is not conditional. If it is a conditional, it is not a moksha. Under certain conditions, moksha you will get. Na that shastra later it negates. What it negates? I am the atma Brahma Swarupam. All these viveka, vairagya, shamadamadi, shatka sampatti, mumukshutvam, all are at vyavaharika level. Nothing to do with me. I am asangaha, mano nigraha, indre nigraha. That condition and my atma swarupam, both are different. There is no connection between moksha and sadhana chetushta sampatti really. Really speaking, factually speaking, but sadhana chetushta ya sampatti as a hobby you can lifelong improve yourself. That is different. But uh, if those conditions are there, only you will get moksha, and then we don't accept. That is adhyaro pakale. Then we negate apavada. I am free from all shama, dama, uparama, titiksha, shraddha, samadhana, viveka, vairagya. I am asanga atma. I am atma swarupam. My moksha swarupam, mukti swarupam is unconditional. Unconditional. It is not depending upon any condition of the mind. It is not depending upon any condition of the intellect. It is not depending upon any condition of sense organs. Even raga, dvesha are there in the mind. I can never deny my atma swarupam. Aham Brahma Asmi. The Lord Krishna said in Bhagavad Gita, raga, dvesha, vyavasthita onar. Likes and dislikes are bound to be there. It is nothing to do with my atma swarupam. That is that called adhyaro, apavada. It is not a conditional moksha. Moksha is unconditional. 
These are the two examples. Creation one example, Adhyaropa Pavada. Sadhana Chetushtaya Sampati, conditional moksha is Adhyaropa. Moksha happens to be unconditional, that is Apavada of Sadhana Chetushtaya Sampati. It does not mean Sadhana Chetushtaya Sampati are useless. It does not mean Sadhana Chetushtaya Sampati are useless. Their utility is there. Their utility is there very much. But what we want to say, if they are there only, moksha is possible, is not correct. Not correct in the sense we deliberately negate that. We deliberately introduced yes sattve, yes siddhyati, yad abhave, yad na siddhyati, moksha, na siddhyati. That we do negation later, apavad. Who did Acharyas only? Adhyaropa also, Apavada also. This is the um, method. Therefore, now you have to come out of that Atma, Anatma division. According to Sankhya, Prakriti is real. Purusha, Prakriti, both are real. That will come later again. We saw previously. Once again it will come. Ataha che atmanaha. For this 95th verse, we are seeing the introduction. Last class I introduced. Ataha, therefore. Therefore means what? Wherefore? Since I am asanga atma. Atmanaha. Veda asparshaha. Veda duality, Dvaitam cannot touch me. They cannot afflict me, they cannot touch me. Asparshaha. Why? Why they cannot touch me? Vedasya mithya um, svabhav, svabhavyad. What is the nature of Veda duality? Uh, Veda is actually speaking. Du duality, Dvaitam, Veda, you cannot see, perceive with your eyes. Veda, you cannot perceive. I see the difference. Na. How can you see the difference? Na? Difference is formless. How can you see? What do we say? We use that word, Veda. We say, Veda is, I am seeing Veda. Na. Hey, Veda, you cannot see exactly your eyes cannot perceive veda because veda is formless it is only a word you are using veda that veda is mithya unreal mithya svabhavya this nature of this veda is unreal ataha therefore aha I am going to talk about that, uh, how this is uh, Mithya, I will tell you. Now, I will introduce this sloka. Up to here, we saw in the last class, next page, page number 80, verse number 95 at the top. Avagatyatmano yasmat Agama pai kum bhavat Sahankaramidam vishwam Tasma tasyatma kacha Tasma tasyat kacha divatim Tatu syat kacha divatim <laughs> now he gives the example reason is explained here within the self alone everything is appearing the reason he is giving why mithya it is why atma doesn't have any bheda any duality so sajatiya bheda internal differences between one Atma and another Atma is negated in 2094 because there are no many Atmas like Sankhya person talks about. There are many Purushas. All pervading Purushas are many. 
as sankhya philosopher says there are no many atmas if many atmas are there that is called sajatiya bheda sajatiya means one atma another atma second atma third atma fourth atma that bheda is not there negated in 94 now in this 95th verse vijatiya uh, bheda is negated how one consciousness and matter has got vijatiya bheda matter is doesn't matter as sankhya philosopher give reality to that matter we don't give reality to the matter because it is doesn't matter for us <laughs> doesn't matter means what it doesn't exist really it is having seeming appearance seeming uh, appearance only doesn't have real existence that is why vijatiya bheda is negated now in this shloka look into this shloka idam vishvam this entire universe sahankaram along with ahankara ahankara is also included in the vishvam the world idam vishvam this entire objective universe along with our own ahankara the ego it is of the nature of agama pai it has got an arrival and departure agama pai nakarantaha napumsaka lingaha agama pai in shabdaha it is visheshanam for vishwam agama pai vishwam so qualifying the vishwam so agama pai vishwam sahankaram along with ahankara it is uh, where from it is emerging out avagatyatmanah yasmad avagatyatmanah is panchami vibhakti sakashat panchami chidrupa avagati means chidrupa the self within the self avagati atmanah means within the self the nature of self is awareness avagati means awareness chaitanya consciousness in that only asmat the whole vishwam and ahankara all are arriving and departing that is why in kaivalya upanishad we sa maye vasakalam jatam मयि सर्व प्रति मयि सर्व लय याति तद्रह्माद्वयमस्म्यहम तत् ब्रह्म अद्वयम ब्रह्म अहमस्मि फ्रॉम मी अलोन एव्रीथिंग विश्व एंड अहंकार जात मये प्रति बिकाज ऑफ मी ओनली दे आर् सस्टेनिंग इन टू मी ओनली दे मेर्ज therefore avagati atmanah yasmad yasmad atmanah agama pai idam vishvam sahankaram along with ahankara just like like a pot kumbhavat like ghatakasha is born no. really speaking in akasha in akasha pot is born <laughs> in akasha pot is born khata akasha is not born pot space is not born in space pot is born in space pot is born there is lot of depth in this sentence in space pot is born let me have a some fun here fun in the sense not a fun but it is very important okay what is that in space pot is born means pot is what mrittika vacharam bhanam vikaro nam adheyam mrittika ityeva satyam mrittika clay where from clay has come bhumi earth where from earth prithvi has come it has come from water where from water has come it has come from agni fire where from agni has come fire has come 
Vayu. Where from Vayu has come? Vayu has come from Akasha. Akasha Dvayu Hu Vayu Ragnihi Agni Rapaha Adhya Prithivi. Prithivi is clay. Clay alone is in the form of pot. Akasha is the Karanam. Pot is the Karyam. Karyam doesn't exist other than Karanam. In Akasha, pot is there. What a brilliant teaching you see this. Hmm? Amazing teaching. If you un understand, you can revel in that. That's why Kumbhavat. Kumbhavat means uh, like uh, the pot in space. Kumbhavat. How far Kumbha doesn't, does Kumbha exist? Kumbha means pot. Does pot exist? No. Clay alone is there. Does clay exist? Earth alone is there. Earth does it exist? Water alone exists. Karanam. Karya means Mithya. Water is Mithya. Fire is real. Fire is Mithya. Vayu is real. Karanam is real. Vayu is also Mithya. Akasha is Satyam. Therefore, in Akasha, pot is there. Like that, like that. Entire Nama Rupa Prapancha, they are in Atma. Ahankara also, within Atma only. What you are talking, Ahankara, non, non, I am, I am. Who is this I am? I am is nothing but a fake I, which is born as it were, from Atma, the Chaitanyam, Chidrupa Atmanaha, Abhagati means Chidrupa Atma. Full stop. After Vishwam, you can put a full stop. Tasmat, therefore, Tat, therefore, this Vishwam, Kachadivat uh, Syad. Kachadivat means. Kachadivat Agamapai Bhavati Vishwam. You have to supply. Kachadivat Agamapai Bhavati. Kacha means Kachadivat means Mitcha Pratiti. Mitcha Pratiti. It is like a rope snake. Snake appearance is Mitcha Pratiti. Marriage water is Mitcha Pratiti. Similarly, shell silver. Mitya Pratiti. Here, Surishwaracharya gives another uh, rare example that is Kachadivat, like a hair. When you have eye problem, uh, once so age is coming, all eye problems will start because of age. Uh, you see something in front of your eyes. Small, small things are moving like, uh, like uh, you know, layers. Hair, small hair is there in front of you, moving in front of your eyes. Therefore, some people see so many things in front of them. Really, they are not there. Because of eye defect, they see hair, they see many other circles or light. So, many things they see. So, something like hallucination. It is like something like hallucination, like ears also. Some people get he hear some sounds. You know? When you go to higher range of him mountains, because of lack of oxygen supply, um, you get a lot of hallucinations. You hear certain sounds, different, different sounds. Nobody is hearing, you only hear. Because of some defect in the ears or some defect in the eyes you see certain forms kachadivat hmm? that um, um, whatever you see in your front of your eyes are they real not they are not real kachadivat syat they are mithya only so the eyes um, problem you see so many things so they are not they are real like that uh, entire vishwam also for ajnani uh, Agnanam blurness is there. <laughs> no eye blindness. Eye blurness. 
but ajnanam it causes blurness that is why we call that uh, jnanam as jnana chakshu jnana chakshu jnana chakshu na is there any other eye physical eye jnana chakshu is antara chakshu antara chakshu antara chakshu is nothing but clear understanding hmm? therefore tasmat tat vishvam kachadivat syat therefore it is unreal unreal why now what is the reason he has given the reason agama payitvat whatever comes and goes it is agama pai agama apayitvam is one of the definition of uh, anatma bhautikatvam sagunatvam agama payitvam savikharatvam all these are all the nature of anatma anatma means what whatever you see is anatma okay remember whatever you see whatever you feel <laughs> all come under anatma nambave mudine swamini kashtama irke kashtame illa whatever you are seeing appearing in front of you experiencing internal and external internal emotions internal feelings external objects all of them are is san mula man vichha you have to go into the root i told you now this example what pot is in akasha i said the commentator elaborately writes on this pot is in akasha kumbhavat akasha means what pot is not there earth is there earth is not there water is there water is not there fire is there fire is not there vayu is there vayu is not there akasha is there therefore pot is in akasha correct like that <laughs> ahankara in the vishwam all these are only you go to final atma swarupam atma in atma only everything is there next uh, introduction verse number 96 therefore they say atma is matchless <laughs> it doesn't have any comparison uh, to compare there is no another atma to compare it is matchless sarvasyaiva anumanam vyaparasya फलमिदम एव फलम यदेव यद विवेक ग्रहणम 96 इंट्रोडक्शन ही सेस अनुमान व्यापारस्य वी हैव टू केयरफुली अंडरस्टैंड दिस अनुमान इज नॉट प्रत्यक्ष अनुमान उपमान anumana there in pratyaksha pramanasla anumana pramanam inferential means that is not the meaning here you should not take that then what you have to take vyavrutasya ityarthah anumana vyaparasya means anuvrutta vyavrutta vicharah anuvrutta vyavrutta vicharah what do you mean by anuvrutta vyavrutta anuvrutta means in hearing in hears vyavrutta means it is not permanently be there it is not always available it sometimes it comes and it goes anuvruttam vyavruttam for example i will tell you what is that you can understand i am old i am hungry i am sad i am sorrowful i am happy all these are vyavrutam they are not consistent they are exclusive when you are happy you are not unhappy when you are unhappy you are not happy that's called vyavrutam vyavrutam means exclusive happiness excludes sorrow sorrowness excludes happiness correct so that which excludes the other called vyavrutam that which is not anuvruttam that which does not 
in years all the time consistently inconsistent thing is called vyavritta old age you are not old all the time you were young adult young later only you became old so old age is vyavritta then what about um, hungry hunger hunger is also vyavritta hunger is vyavritta why you are always not hungry when you food take food you feel stomach full hunger goes agama bai similarly sorrow also you are always not sorrowful sometimes happy like beep beep light madri disco lights like you know, happiness comes and goes comes and goes agama pai like that agama pai here vyavrittam it is called anuvrittam is what uh, in dakshina murti stotram visa balya dishva pi jagrada dishu tatha sarva svavastha svapi vyavritta svanu vartamanam ahami am tasuram tam sada i am the sakshi who is the witnesser of hunger who is the witnesser of sadness who is the witnesser of happiness who is the witnesser of old age symptoms who is the witnesser of all disease symptoms i am anuvrittam i alone was uh, once in boyhood i alone was in youthhood i alone am in old age now suppose i alone was uh, uh, the waker i alone was the dreamer i alone am sleeper sleeper excludes the waker waker excludes the dreamer 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 excludes the waker so waker is there dreamer is not there when dreamer is there sleeper is not there when sleeper is there waker is not there therefore avastha trayam each excludes but i the avastha traya sakshi the witnesser of waking stage the witnesser of dream state the witnesser of sleep state anuvrittam that is called anumana here anumana vyaparasya anuvrittam vyavritta vicharah ityarthah yat avadhyam tat anuvrittam if you want to hear in sanskrit yat avadhyam that which is not negatable at any period of time is called anuvrittam yat avadhyam that which is unnegatable avadhyam is unnegatable it is not there in the shloka i am telling yat avadhyam tat anuvrittam yat badhyam tat vyavrittam clear yat badhyam that which is negatable is vyavrittam the yat vyavrittam that anvrutam tat anvrutam whatever is abadhyam that is anvrutam that is satyam whatever is badhyam negatable that is vyavrutam that is anrutam that is mithya old age is mithya because it is vyavrutam youth hood is mithya that is vyavrutam body is mithya it is vyavrutam your intellect your mind your emotions your family members from positions all everything all are changing vyavrutam so this is the la yad avadhyam tat यत् अनुवृत्तं तत् सत्यं यत् अवाध्यं यत् अनुवृत्तं तत् सत्यं यत् बाध्यं यत् व्यावृत्तं तत् मिथ्या अनृतं दिस इज द आइडिया नाउ लुक इन टू द पोर्शन स्वस्य एव सर्वस्य एव ऑफ ऑल दिस एंटायर यूनिवर्स अनुमान व्यापारस्य दैट व्हिच हैज गॉट अन व्यापारस्य दट इज व्यावृत्तस्य व्यावृत्तस्य फलम इयदेव फलम इयदेव रिजल्ट ऑफ ऑल एंक्वायरीज रिजल्ट ऑफ ऑल दीज एंक्वायरीज 
he is only this much whatever enquiry you do in the jagat uh, all you are doing about enquiry anything they are all come under vyavrutam the enquirer <laughs> enquirer is anuvrutam correct all is this much only tat vichyate that is explain in this 96th verse buddhere buddheranatmadharmastva anumanat prasidhyati atmanopyadvitiyatva atmatvadeva siddhyati atma is advitiyam we say atma is non dual that non duality of atma is not an attribute of atma non duality of atma advitiyam tvam the nature advitiya tvam means what non dual nature non dual nature is not an attribute of atma atma nature it is that is swabhava heat is not the attribute of fire heat ushnata is not the attribute of fire any attribute will come and go but fire never leave that attribute it is always anuvrutam it is not vyavrutam water is hot na that is vyavrutam previously it was cold now it is hot later sometime it becomes cold it is vyavrutam the heat in the water is vyavrutam the heat in the fire is anuvrutam this is the best example to remember to know what is anuvrutam what is vyavrutam the heat in the water is vyavrutam agama pai you need not do anything boil water and keep some time automatically water become cold vyavrutam or anuvrutam the heat vyavrutam it goes agama pai whereas fire you know, fire there is cold fire swami in my house and uh, even you go to polar region also uh, you cannot uh, see any um, cold fire fire uh, heat is the ushnyam is the nature of fire it is not the attribute of fire why na attribute comes and goes nature will not come and go like that like that here also buddhi is like water heat <laughs> uh, heat in the water um, atma is like uh, um, fire okay i hope these two examples you can apply to atma and anatma ahankara buddhi he anatma dharmatvam buddhi is having anatma dharma <coughs> it is um, <coughs> having no buddhi when you are in jagrat avastha buddhi is actually functioning when you are in dream avastha your buddhi is not functioning another buddhi is functioning in the dream dream buddhi but in the waker's buddhi is not functioning there in deep sleep totally passive what happened to your buddhi intellect therefore it is anatma whatever is anatma is mithya anrutam vyavrutam non self what is anatma non self atma means self anatma means non self whatever is non self is mithya anatm dharmatvam buddhe he i don't experience anything when i go to deep sleep i don't experience anything anatm dharmatvam anumanat prasidhyati here anumanat means again you should not take anumana pramanam or inference 
you have to take anvaya vetreka logic anvaya vetreka or vyavritta anuvritta logic which is um, um, nothing but um, a distinction that is negatable later siddhyati means um, corroborated what is corroborated consolidated substantiated anumanat prasiddhyati because of anvaya vitreka buddhi jagrat avasthayam buddhi satvam sapna avasthayam buddhi asatvam buddhi is not functioning uh, so sushupta avasthayam api na therefore hmm? anumanat anvaya vitrekat jagrat satve buddhi satvam jagrat abhave buddhi abhava jagrat means waking state hmm. now you, know, you are in waking state when class is going on when you go to sleep night uh, deep sleep naishkarma siddhi comes in your mind 95th verse 96th verse uh, it may come in dream suppose <laughs> it may come in dream but not in sleep what happened to your naishkarma siddhi intelligence what happened to your naishkarma siddhi intelligence tell me anuvritta vyavritta anuvritta maavada vyavritta maavada nothing is there Uh, apai apai gone for good dinner again tomorrow morning you get up it comes again arrival and departure but atmanah api advitiyatvam atmatvadeva siddhyati through anvaya vitreka you get uh, uh, buddhi status what is buddhi its nature you understand but how to know atma atma because of it is it, um, non dual therefore it is atman hey non duality is not an attribute to know atma i know atma through non dual nature na. how do you know non dual nature i know fire through heat na. i know fire through heat heat alone is fire you cannot know fire through heat <laughs> okay it is the nature of fire therefore you know the fire you know the heat you know the heat you know the fire nanna irka parunga you know the heat na enak heat theriyum fire theriyadanna fire theriyum heat theriyadanna are acid fire da heat heat da fire na fire vera heat vera ka illa எது ஹீட்டாக இருக்கோ அதுதான் ஃபயரு எது ஃபயரோ அதே ஹீட்டு அது மாதிரி எது அத்வயமோ அதுதான் ஆத்மா எது ஆத்மாவோ அதுதான் அத்வயம் ஓகே அத்வித்தியத்வம் வென் யூ டாக் அப்ஸ்ட்ராக்ட் நவுன் அத்வித்தியத்வம் நான் ட்யூவல் நான் ட்யூயாலிட்டி ரியல்லி ஸ்பீக்கிங் யூ கெனாட் நோ ஆத்மா த்ரூ அத்வித்தியத்வம் எது அத்வித்தீயமோ அதுதான் ஆத்மா எது ஆத்மாவோ அதுதான் அத்வித்தீயம் ஃபயர் ஹீட் மாதிரி எனக்கு அந்த எக்ஸாம்பிள் ரொம்ப பிடிச்சிருக்கு ஓகே ஆத்மனக அப்படி அத்வித்தீயத்வம் ஆத்மத்வாதேவ சித்தி த்ரூ ஆத்மா ஓன்லி யூ கம் டு நோ தேட் நாட் த்ரூ எனி திங் பிகாஸ் தெர் இஸ் நோ செகண்ட் திங் டு நோ த்ரூ திஸ் ஆத்மா பிகாஸ் தெர் இஸ் நோ செகண்ட் திங் டு நோ because through anything you know any pramanam is uh, um, doesn't function with regard to atma to know atma yende pramanam varkaham chakshu pramanam srotra pramanam manas buddhi no only shabda pramanam mahavakya shabda pramanam you cannot know through any means even that mahavakya shabda pramanam also what this is not atma this is not atma only shastra says shastra never says even through shabda pramana also idi da atman chalali epame idi atma illa idi atma illa idi atma illa nu sonnade thavare idi atma nu epame chalala adi nalla purinchukonam so therefore therefore what now advitiyatvam 
ஆத்மத்வாதேவ தி சப்ஜெக்ட் நெஸ் ஈஸ் யூ கேன் நோ த சப்ஜெக்ட் ஆத்மா ஓன்லி த்ரூ த சப்ஜெக்ட் ஆத்மத்வாதேவ த சப்ஜெக்ட் இஸ் சப்ஜெக்ட் as long as it has got subject to hood if you want to know this we saw already if you want to know the atma the subject okay that uh, loses its subject to hood correct i want to know the atma the subject na if you know atma the subject it cannot be the subject it will become object because the subject you know only through the subject not through any object not as an object not as an object if any one says what guru keno upanishad guru said if you know i know atma you don't know sishya also said i know atma and i don't know atma i know and i don't know na i don't want to enter into that it is your homework i know i don't know what it means and like darya chulrika keno upanishadlo you can look into that this is siddhyati so atmatva deva atma is that which is all pervading apnoti sarvam iti atma that which is there in the form of is 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 in everything all the time chidrupena sadrupena sarvada vartate that atma you cannot know if you know it loses its subjecthood as long as it is subject it is atma that is you the consciousness next verse 97 introduction i will introduce yadyapi ayam grahitra grahitu grahana grahya grihiti தலாத்மக ஆபிரமஸ்தம்பரியம்தாரிமாலியவத் அபவித in this uh, verse uh, 97th verse introduction what sureshwara acharya want to say another adhyaropa <laughs> uh, adhyaropa is what uh, what shastra says the whole world is having not uh, dukham you see that dukha in the world dukha dosha darshanam is important vyadhi jara marana so many are there don't carry away by this world you withdraw from the world you antar mukham become like that shastra says because shastra says there were guru also says what to do we also say that only hmm? dukha dosha darshanam also we say always look at the world it is the problem causing sorrow causing hmm? lot of triputi is there hmm? grihita the one who is the pramata grihita means pramata here then grahanam grahanam means not chandra grahanam surya grahanam here grahanam means pramanam pramanam anuman pratyaksha anumana upamana like that pramanam is so pramata is grah pramanam is grahanam pramata the subject the knower pramata grahitahu pramanam then grahyam the object triputi and uh, grahi grihiti means experience so the triad triputi the whole triputi we introduce you the subject whole world is object prameyam you are sense organs called pramanam you are looking at the world you are seeing the all problems i have people also say i am sorrowful i have lot of problems i have lot of confusions like that they go on telling for that shastra says yes we introduce that what ninda 
ವಾಟ್ ನಿಂದ ಸಂಸಾರ ನಿಂದ ದ ಹೋಲ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಈಸ್ ಎ ಬಾಂಡೇಜ್ ಬಂಧ ಪುತ್ರ ವಿತ್ತ ವಿಚಾರ ಸಾಗರ ವಿ ಆರ್ ಸೀನ್ ಪುತ್ರ ಧನ ಗೃಹ ಪತ್ನಿ ಪತಿ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ಆಲ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ ಕಾಸಿಂಗ್ ಲೈಕ್ ದಟ್ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಟಾಕ್ಸ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಯುವರ್ ಬಾಡಿ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಯುವರ್ ಪೊಸಿಷನ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಆರ್ ಗೋಯಿಂಗ್ ಟು ಗಿವ್ ಯು ದುಃಖ ಓನ್ಲಿ ಸೊ ಸ್ಟೂಡೆಂಟ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ನಾಟ್ ಹಿಸ್ ಹೆಡ್ ಅಮ್ಮ 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 ಕರೆಕ್ಟ್ ದ ಐ ದಿ ಸಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ಪ್ರಮಾತ ನೋವರ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ದ ನೋವರ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿಸ್ ಹೋಲ್ ಯೂನಿವರ್ಸ್ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ಸ್ ದೇ ಆರ್ ಗಿವಿಂಗ್ ಲಾಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಪ್ರಾಬ್ಲಮ್ಸ್ ಐ ಆಮ್ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮೈಸ್ಡ್ ದ ಹೋಲ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಈಸ್ ವಿಕ್ಟಿಮೈಸಿಂಗ್ ಮೀ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಐ ನೀಡ್ ಸೇವಿಯರ್ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಭಗವಾನ್ ಕಾಪತ್ತು ಅವ್ರ ಮೇಲೆ ಇರ್ಕಾರ್ ಅಪ್ಪನೇ ಅಂದರೆ ನಮ್ಮ ಮೇಲೆ ಪಾಪು ಮೇಲೆ ಪಾಕಣ ಅಪ್ಪಡಿ ಏನು ಅರ್ಥ ತ್ರಿಪುಟಿ ಇತ್ಯರ್ಥ ತ್ರಿಪುಟಿ ವಾಟ್ ತ್ರಿಪುಟಿ ನಾನ್ ಸಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ದ ಎಂಟೈರ್ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಬ್ಜೆಕ್ಟ್ ವಿಚ್ ಈಸ್ ಸಂಸಾರ ಕಾಸಿಂಗ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಐ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಫ್ರೀ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸಂಸಾರ ಹೂ ವಿಲ್ ಗಿವ್ ದಟ್ ರಿಲೀಫ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ಮೀ ರಿಲೀವ್ ಫ್ರಮ್ ದಿಸ್ ಸಂಸಾರ ಭಗವಾನ್ ದೇರ್ ಫಾರ್ ಐ ವಾಂಟ್ ಟು ವರ್ಷಿಪ್ ಹಿಮ್ ಆಲ್ ದ ಪ್ರೇಯರ್ಸ್ ಆಲ್ ದಟ್ ವಾಟ್ ವಿ ಟೀಚ್ ಆಲ್ ಆರ್ ರಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿಂಗ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ಅನದರ್ ವಿಪರೀತ ಭಾವನ ಡೆಲಿವರೇಟ್ಲಿ ವೈ ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸ್ ತ್ರಿಪುಟಿ ಈಶ್ವರ ಇಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಡು ಪ್ರೇಯರ್ ಈಶ್ವರ ಪ್ರಣಿಧಾನ ಎಸ್ ದಿಸ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ಸೋ ಅನದರ್ ಇನ್ ಎನದರ್ ಅಧ್ಯಾರೋಪ ರಿಯಲ್ಲಿ ಸ್ಪೀಕಿಂಗ್ ದೇರ್ ಇಸ್ ನೋ ವರ್ಲ್ಡ್ which is causing me any pain or sorrow to run away. I need not run away from this world. I need not run away from this body. I am Atma ever free Mukta Swarupaha in spite of this uh, uh, turbulent mind. I am Atma in spite of this um, diseased body. I am the Atma in spite of this problems around me. Really speaking, the whole world is in me, the Atma. I need not run away from the At- world. I need not seek someone to save me. Because I cannot. Because the whole world is Mayeva Sakalan Jatam. it is manifesting out of me how can i run away from this world why to run away if it is real like that person after seeing the rope snake he is doing prayer lot of prayer and puja swami jokla says a person is calling that ch- snake charmer snake charmer he is calling and uh, asking in the mantra to send that sarpa hmm? non existent sarpa sik uh, and pambatti karana vande pipi 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 pen you will blow, hmm? blow that na no? like mongoose it appears like mongoose so that pomb will go away in the rope snake ki edavadu pannanuma you want to run away from the rope snake huh? people want to run away from the rope snake and a non existent snake gaudapada acharya beautifully bombarded in mandukya upanishad that you want to run away from this world which is like a rope snake you piravi venda it is the last janma i don't want to get next janma i don't want to get the next birth i am ready to get next birth all births bars bodies are born in me they are existing because of me they merge in me appudu sollanu people say this is the last birth swami i want to attain moksha somehow anyhow you already mukta you need not attain moksha you need not really speaking you cannot why you are already mukta how can you get moksha amma romba kashtama irukka swami nedena idu da unmai ಇದೆಲ್ಲ ಲಾಸ್ಟ್ ಸ್ಟೇಜ್ ಇಲ್ಲದ ಸೊಲ್ವ ಅದೇನಾದ್ರು ಯು ಆರ್ ನೈಶ್ ಕರಿಮೆ ಸಿದ್ಧಿ 
அதர்வைஸ் இதெல்லாம் கொஞ்சம் ஹெவி ஹெவியெல்லாம் புரியாது அதனால தெர் இஸ் நோ நெசசிட்டி ஆஃப் கெட்டிங் மோக்ஷா தெர் இஸ் ஓன்லி நெசசிட்டி ஆஃப் ரிமூவிங் தி ஐடியா ஆஃப் எஸ்கேப்பிங் திஸ் ஃப்ரம் திஸ் பாடி எஸ்கேப்பிங் ஃப்ரம் திஸ் வேர்ல்டு தட் நோஷன் ஃப்ரம் தட் நோஷன் யூ ஹாவ் டு எஸ்கேப் ஃப்ரம் தட் நோஷன் யூ ஹாவ் டு எஸ்கேப் யூ நீட் நாட் எஸ்கேப் ஃப்ரம் த வேர்ல்ட் வேர்ல்ட் இஸ் இன் மீ வேர்ல்ட் இஸ் எக்ஸிஸ்டிங் பிகாஸ் ஆஃப் மீ தி ஆத்மா வை டு ரன் அவே ஃப்ரம் த வேர்ல்ட் வை டு ரன் டுவர்ட்ஸ் காட் ஓ சேவ் மீ என்ன ஈஸ்வர ஆல்சோ ஐ ஆம் வேர்ல்ட் இஸ் ஆல்சோ ஐ ஆம் எவ்ரி திங் ஐ ஆம் ஆத்ம சைத்தன்யம் அதுதான் உண்மை ஓம் பூர் நமத பூர் நமிதம் பூர் நாத் பூர் நமுதட்சதே பூர் நஸ்ய பூர் நமாதாய பூர் நமேவாவசிஷ்யதே ஓம் சாந்தி 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 ஹரி ஓம் ஸ்ரீ குருபோ நம ஹரி ஓம் ஐ ஹாவ் ஒன் அனௌன்ஸ்மெண்ட்